This episode is sponsored by the following Patreons. Thank you so, so much for supporting this show. If you want to be a Patreon and get exclusive benefits, you can sign up at a link in the description. Players are competing for a one-of-a-kind totem pole prize package. The winner will receive a cash prize, merch, and their own totem pole spin-off show that will air after season three. It is time for the top of the totem pole challenge. The winner of this challenge will have to rank every other player on the totem pole from top to bottom. This challenge is the more or less challenge. Players must study an image. Then they will have to answer questions more or less. If they are correct, they will get to come up to the table and move a player's block. Each player has three lives in this game, and every time a block is moved, that player loses a life. As the players go down the table, when they're eventually put into the luggage, they are out of this challenge. After the more or less portion of this challenge, we will move into a new phase. This challenge is called Reveal Your Baggage. The Wesley is Place challenges to me, it go in one ear out the other. So half the time, I'm really confused, but I'm not at the same time. I'm not studying these pictures. In my head, I'm like, I'm gonna wing it. I might win it. So why would I try and study these pictures? So I was just looking around just because everybody else was looking around at the pictures. I didn't know what I was doing. I'm like, I'm just gonna write more or less. And maybe, just maybe, I'll be lucky enough to get the answer right. So I walk into challenge number two, and it's the more or less competition. And let me just tell you, I'm not really good at remembering things. Like I, <laughs> when they put those things down for us to look at them, I was like, oh, Okay, I'm trying to make sense of it because I'm like, there's there's names, I counted the names. And I was like, all right, there's, there's circles, so let me count the circles. I was like, let me count faces. I made sure I studied every single thing on that picture to give me the best outcome for this game. And I think I'm ready for it. Before confessionals in the last round, uh, Wesley gave us a piece of paper and asked us some questions about our fellow castmates, including like who's the friendliest, who's a snake in the house, and I have a feeling, I think I know where this is going, and I think it's gonna play out later on in this game. But by the time I was done counting everything and we lined up to do the competition, I done forgot all of it. <laughs> than two times. But what? <laughs> That's what I was really curious about. <laughs> so wait. <laughs> what do you mean? Like, okay, so when Wesley say at least two times, that's two times or less, right? The question was more or less than two times. And I put less because he was on there two times. He was on there was three. On there three How? There's, he's two pictures. There was his little picture and then his signature. And, and then his in... block was in the back of another picture. And I did see that. <clears throat> oh my god. <laughs> anyway, I look, this ain't no map. <laughs> 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 this ain't no math class. I don't understand. Okay, I have a few <laughs> Y'all, if y'all knew me in school, don't show this to my job applications because I'm gonna work in a hospital and they're gonna be like, this girl can't decide if it's gonna be more or less than ibuprofen. <laughs> <laughs> Baby girl gave me those pounds last round, so <laughs> oh, that's me. 
Okay, so I'm just gonna repay some favors. No hard feelings, you already know. Derek, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to move you over. Um, I'm moving this person because they said they're okay with this. So, no hard feelings at all. Moving Tessa over. Um, this is only because, like, I'm still trying to talk to everyone. I've probably talked to this person individually, probably the least. So I'm sorry, Madison. <laughs> first round, I get one right, and uh, Jackie is the first person I move. You know, I'm not worried about. Her knowing I'm coming for her, she came for me the first round. If anything, it's payback. <sighs> okay, so this is kind of also based off of uh, I haven't gotten to subscribe to quite everybody yet and talk to them, so I'm sorry, Connor. Was CJ from season two on the paper, either her face or name, more or less than one time? The correct answer was more. So I could less drop her name. <laughs> Wing it. Can't y'all, I'm so freaking lucky in this game. I might just take the top of the totem pole again. <laughs> Madison, you can go to the bottom. I'll bop, bop, bop to the bottom. I'm confused. I thought we were good. I thought we had, we talked. I mean, you and Derek talked. I don't understand. Okay, I'm just doing this because I feel like if I do it, then you won't hate me because I love you. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god, never mind. <laughs> Kadia, what are you? What what are you doing? What are you? She's like, Jace, you gonna be mad if I move and I'm like, yes, I'm gonna be mad if you move you move mine. What are you? Okay, what did I do? What did I do? I barely gave him any weight. This man gave me over 100 pounds. I thought we were even. What's happening now? We are now moving on to phase two in this challenge. In your last confessionals, you filled out a survey full of questions about your fellow cast members. You will now write down the name of a player. I will ask a question that was from the survey. You will write down the name of the player you believe the majority said. If you are correct, you will come up and move a block. 
that it was no longer more or less, but it was these dang on questions that we answered in round one about our contestants. Cause so I was like, oh yeah, Sabrina, she's my, you know, she's my number one. Like, you know, so I didn't think these were things I was gonna have to reveal this early in the game. Write down the name of the person you think the majority said is the funniest and reveal. <laughs> the correct answer was Josh. If you did not say Josh, I want to be more of an even playing field, so I'll just stay up with you. Jace. I'm gonna do it, just to keep it all over. Okay, but why are you getting you know? Alright, Madison, if you have been eliminated, please step to the back. <clears throat> Your next question. <laughs> Who do you believe the majority said is the friendliest? The correct answer was Shane. Just so it's even, just so it's even. Yeah, <laughs> yeah just take it. Fair enough. Oh my gosh. Okay. Um. Woo! No hard feelings, I'm sorry. <laughs> Who do you believe the majority said should have won the last challenge? The correct answer was either Josh or Tessa. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I love this for myself. Okay, um... <sighs> Jackie, I'm going with your vlog, I'm sorry. So I wanted to come up here so bad, but I, uh, let's see. He looks good, so we won't touch him. Uh, <laughs> Connor, my man. <laughs> <laughs> right back at you, Tessa. Sorry. <laughs> Who do you believe the majority said is the biggest threat? Majority said that they believed Derek is the biggest yes, threat. Yes, 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 yes. Kadia, since you. Who's next?
I'm sorry, Jada. I don't know what's going on here. I thought Kadia and I were at least friendly with each other, but now I realize that she might possibly be coming for me. I don't know why I came into this game thinking that everyone was gonna love me, everything was gonna be fine, because let me walk you through, let me, just memory lane of all the trashy hands I've been dealt since the beginning of this game. The first round, Connor gives me baggage. Then, Tessa wins and goes to the top of the totem pole and puts me at the bottom. Then, they eliminate my best friend in the game. Then, Connor comes for me again. Then, you have Kadia that gets me out of the game. For what? This is ridiculous. Only because you made <laughs> Write down the name of the person that you believe the majority said is the weakest link. Really? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. The correct answer was Connor. I knew it! <laughs> so I got voted the weakest and I wish I could come out here and say like, oh, me? I'm the weakest? I'm so shocked. But like, I knew, my name was on, I knew what I was doing. I'm, I voted myself too, I knew, was, I knew that's what people were gonna say. So for me, like, I know what people think. I mean, I know that I'm, just cause I don't have freaking boulders on my arms and I can run up hills like nobody's business. Like, I know where I stand with that. I know how people view me. And so honestly, I'm actually okay with it because weak eagles kind of non-threatening and anything that lowers my threat factor works for me. So I'm weak all day. So, oh my God. <laughs> so Luke, whenever you first move, you move mine. Oh. Look, 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 we're even. We're even. You, you, no, 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 you, no, we're even. You took my vote? No, bro, we're even. You gave me 40 pounds, we're even. Uh, okay. Listen, listen, listen. I know we've had our issues in the past, but we are even now. You do not need to be moving my block, period. You won the last challenge, and it's only for the week. I mean, I know the challenge, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Lord! <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> Looks like in the spot to start everyone. <laughs> I never moved you. Did I? <laughs> so Connor's doing me dirty and moving my block multiple times, and I don't know why, because all I've done has been nice to him. Yeah, I did. That was not me. He's that like, not me. <laughs> Next question. Write down the name of the person you believe the majority said has the most alliances. Who has the most alliances? Oh, I love that. Oh, <laughs> Kadia, what is on your board? <laughs> Y'all look. <laughs> Anyways, the majority said that they believe Derek has the most alliances. <laughs> If you, I'm you know, freaking out right now. I'm being voted as the biggest threat. Not only is the biggest threat, but I also got voted as the person who has the most alliances. Where are they? I have not made one alliance yet. I'm hoping they come to me after this, but I think this just put me in hot water. Mm. 
Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, look, I didn't move you again. I know, I know you didn't. I gotta move somebody over here. Why did you move over there? Because. It's only two. Yeah, it's only two, exactly. I know, yeah. man, one of them was me. It's another one. Shame. <laughs> <laughs> Still, it's okay. It's, it's all there. I gotta do it, Jack. I'm sorry. We're moving to the final phase of this challenge. Reveal your baggage. We are going to ask you questions and you have to write down your answer you wrote on the survey. We have them, we have the receipts, you want them? Dude, whenever we have to reveal this information about these people, I am instantly so uncomfortable. Like, we have to reveal our baggage to everybody. I'm not about that, I'm gonna play this safe. People's opinions are gonna come out for this game and I'm extremely nervous. Because I don't know what people think of me. I haven't talked to many people. I've kind of stick to myself and I don't know what's gonna happen and I'm extremely nervous. In our last confessionals, we had to fill out a questionnaire and I'm thinking, and they, well they told us that it was to help us keep track of all the game and who we like and who don't we like, da, 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 all that, blah, blah, blah. So I'm over here like, this person, who's a snake? This person, they never gonna see this. This person, they never gonna see this. And then they said they took the questionnaires and made them into questions. <laughs> All right, so we get exposed. Well, I'm, I don't care. <laughs> I'm a, and then he told us that we had to answer truthfully. <laughs> I don't care. I'm going to do it. I don't care. But then I realized that I put Derek on there about four, five times. And he said it not right next to Josh, Josh is right next to me. This challenge just got crazy. It's time to reveal our baggage. I did not come to Total Pole to make friends. I came here to play the game, so let's do it. I'm ready to reveal anything I gotta reveal if it's gonna get me to the top of the Totem Pole. First question. Who is your ride or die ally? Jace, you were up first. Reveal who you said is your ride or die ally. Tell us, say the name. Derek. Yeah, tell me you put me in. Derek, who did you say is your ride or die ally? Thank you, Josh. You put me in. Oh, what? man. That's all right. That's all right. I'm not going to have a little hurt. I'm going to reveal any answers because it's going to hurt people's feelings, which in turn would hurt my connections in the game, which in the long run could end my game. I put you, but it's all right. So Connor, I know I told you I wouldn't get you this round, so I'm gonna keep that. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, Shane and Jay, y'all have been sitting pretty. Right. right. Let's right. just, you know, even it out for the terms. Uh, we'll go Shane. <laughs> <laughs> Who is your target this round? You know what it is. Don't do it. I'm ready. Kadia, who was your target this round? Asher. And Derek, who was, was. your okay. Kadia, you're up first. If I move your block, you're gonna move mine, ain't you? Because you're that baby. Right? If I move before your block. Before we talk, let's make that very clear. Asher was my target before I talked to Asher. So yeah. If I move your block, you gonna move mine because you petty, huh? I mean, yeah, you are. <laughs> Connor, I'm sorry. Connor, just go over here. 
Now, I didn't look it up. Two times, that's two. And there it is. Chase. Put your name down, man. And they got Kadia mad at me. We're all over here, Jace, and then you're just right, sitting, you're there. sitting there. Yeah, let's even it out. Oh. Let's keep it fair. <laughs> Next question. Who do you believe should not have made it past the first round? Let's go. Don't reveal it. Okay, Derek, who did you say? Lower, Jackie. So everyone is doing the challenge because I'm already out, and they ask, who doesn't deserve to be in this round? And Derek wrote my name. I'm actually really butthurt about it because he literally just saved me. He said he wasn't gonna vote me out. And he had two votes. What are you doing? Like, I thought we were cool, but I guess we're not cool, so. And Kadia, who did you say? Me. You put yourself. Yeah. <laughs> this is tough. Y'all know that. It's only five of us left. Tough challenge. Tough spot to be in. Um. Dude. Um. <laughs> okay, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, Shane. Oh, she's a cracker. This right now, you should have nothing to freaking worry about. And the fact that you don't know that really pisses me off. Do you trust Kadia? Yes, I trust Kadia. I trust Kadia. What I don't trust is her strategy. Because, like, all the time I'm like, girl, what is the strategy right here? Like, the first round when she was like, oh, like, when they all, all the top eight or nine or whatever it was, all secluded together, where's the strategy in that? Here she is about to move me, one of her top alliances. And girl, if I win, it's me and you at the top. Why are you? Ah, I don't know. I can't. I can't. I can't. Oh, it makes my brain hurt. It makes my brain hurt. And so, yes, I trust Kadia. I trust her, but I don't trust her strategy. Write down the name of the person you think is the snake. Well, I was first person out, but that doesn't mean that I can't watch the game. So we're just standing in this little little door frame of that is between the kitchen and the living room. And I get to see everything that's happening. So they ask us, who do you think is a snake in the group? On my paper is Madison, so that means I gotta write Madison on the board because we can't lie. And I see her <laughs> little head in the kitchen. <laughs> she, <laughs> I see her little head in the kitchen. She, she, she poking around the corner. I said, oh, I'm about to hurt some feelings today. Cause I just, I didn't think I was gonna have to I mean, I don't mind saying it out loud. Honestly, I don't care. I'm gonna hold it up. Madison. Derek, you were first. Please reveal your baggage. Mm -hmm. And Kadia, who did you say was the biggest snake? Madison. And then I see her face. She's like. <laughs> but then I look over. Luke had to say. <laughs> So that means two great minds think alike. We own to you. Dia puts up her answer that Madison is the biggest snake in the house, and Madison gets really, really upset. She is about to cry, and I can tell that the drama is about to begin. I'm upset because my name's on the bo their boards, and they're calling me a snake, and I don't know these people. And I was so excited for Kadia whenever she walked in this door, and why am why am I a snake? Why, am, why does she think I'm a snake? What have I done to her that makes her think I'm a snake? Girl, why are you being so dramatic? It's not even that serious. It's just a game. We were just throwing down names. <laughs> There's no reason to be upset. All right. Derek, please come up and do the walk. 
I'm shaking, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You, oh, my gosh. What did they do to you? What did they do? How many things? What did they do? during this round right here to just try to get Kadir to throw this challenge to me because I know that Kadir will be 100% safe in this moment but I know that I'm in trouble. All of these people literally just heard me say everything that I had to say negatively about them. They saw it on a board. So if I can get Kadir to throw this challenge to me right now, I think I'll be in a good spot. I'm going, if, if I don't go to the top video. Yeah, I feel like if Madison gets to switch to the board, it's great. <laughs> They're not gonna switch you. They're literally not going to switch you. I'm gonna be in trouble if it I'm not. It depends on who Nicole picked. Like a crowd in the background that was like, no, like Kadia should do what she wants to do. She needs to make up her own mind. Like, don't let Derek convince you to put him at the top of the totem pole. Because honestly, they can mess up everything. Because Derek is really dramatic. Just like y'all seen in the first round, how he went off on Nicole. Honestly, you can't trust Derek. Because first of all, he picked power. So what if Kadeel lets him win and then he puts her at the bottom like he cannot be trusted? Kadeel, what are you thinking, girl? Absolutely not. If you give this to Derek, he's going to target me. We need to be able to work together. Not with him. Kadeel, it is your turn yeah, but to they, come up and move Just a wall. second. I promise you she'll be coming. Kadeel, please come they, up and they, move they, your block. They, I'm sitting here trying to convince Kadeel that right now I think the best move for her would be to... Let me be at the top of the totem pole. I will keep her safe. They're not gonna switch her and put her at the bottom. And then this round would solely just be, let's take out one of those trio members and then we'll keep going with round three. Okay, but you're safe either way though. No, I'm not. The switch can switch me out. Yeah, they're gonna touch you. Kidia, please come out and move your block. Oh. My, he's in my ear the whole time. He's telling me, if he was like, I have a target on my back because I just did this to Nicole and they're gonna try and get me out. What they gotta do with me? I didn't do that. You did. And so he's in my ear and I'm kind of hesitant. Maybe this will be able, this will show him that he can trust me so I can hopefully trust him not to put me at the bottom. And so I'm hesitating to put my block in the bag. Yeah, really, 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 really. If they switch me, I'm gonna be really mad at you. It's best that I win right now in this moment. I just taken power. Everybody has it out for me right now. At least that's how I feel. They're all giving me these stink eyes. They're all sitting in the back just looking at me. I'm freaking out. I need Kadia to let me have this. Please, Kadia, just let me have this one. I will look out for you. Derek is not here for you like that. I'm gonna just be honest. I think Derek is trying to get under everyone's skin just a little bit to be like, just trust me. Just do. But we also saw what happened with Nicole. So why would everyone think that it's okay for Kadia to just accept this deal? No, save yourself, girl. Please move a block. Oh my gosh, <laughs> why? Don't make me count you down. You may have to. But Kadia has the leg up. All she has to do is just put his block and the, the thing is she wins, it's simple. It should have been done like that. But there was some dialogue between the two and Derek was trying to get his way, you know, as anyone should. And I don't know if that was smart for him to go as hard as he did, but he went in. And let me tell you, the girlies next to me, while this challenge was going on, they were pissed. They were like, Kadia, you better take this. Like, don't give it to Derek. Derek was already ruffling some feathers with them and I'm just kind of like, <laughs> Kadia, don't ruffle the feathers. Take it. Take it. Why are you why are you pondering this? There's no need to ponder, all right? Take the top of the totem pole. What are you doing? You just saw this dude eliminate someone last round. You think he's gonna treat, keep keep his word to you? What? What are you doing? Take the win. It's an easy win. I don't know what Derek is saying to you right now, but like, girl. Take the win. What are you? No, stop, stop. Take the strategy. This is what I just, mm, I can't. If your strategy does not make sense in my brain. Like, okay, like I get it. Like if you wanna, you wanna put Derek so you're not the top. Okay, but then like everybody knows you through the challenge. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know. Uh, take the win. Please take the win and then save me. Please, please.
Three. I don't know. I'm, I'm just. Two. One. Zero. Decide. Now. Grab a block. <laughs> Why? But then I'm thinking, that's stupid. Why would I put my block in the bag? <laughs> stupid. Oh, oh, what the heck? Derek, I'm sorry. You won in the bag. Sorry. Oh, Congratulations, Kadia. Oh, you are. Oh, finally, the turtle is blocked. <laughs> I like clouds. I cut hard. I said, Who is clapping? What's the point of that? I think it's nasty. I think it's malicious. And if you want to see me out the game that bad, do something else. But the clapping thing, that was too much. I'm not happy. I feel like people are clapping because I just lost this challenge. So you want to play dirty? Let's the games begin. So after the challenge, Everyone started clapping because like Kadia won, Kadia won, and then Derek goes, who's clapping over there? I looked at Derek and I saw his facial expression when Kadia chose to save herself and everybody was happy about it and I purposefully chose not to clap. Everybody starts clapping, I'm not a happy camper, and I noticed Luke, he, I think he says who, so when you give me that tone, I'm ready to give you that tone back, so in this moment, let's go Luke. I said sure. I said sure. Uh, yeah. Jada, you clapped as well. Jackie. Yeah. I Madison. I don't know. Well, you call me a snake, so what do you expect? I'm gonna call this hashtag clapgate2020. I started clapping! Stop this one. So, he lives the challenge and I start clapping because this means that the person who literally has now blocked my vote, given me weight, and tried to take me out of the challenge has no power to put me on the bottom. So I know that with him not winning this challenge, I have a better of a chance to be safe. So I clap because hello, I'm gonna put myself first in this game. I literally, I literally had to write. I literally told everybody before we wrote that down that I literally went to that paper writing anything on that paper. I literally uh, said that so I many guess times. I didn't hear that. I'm sorry. So, but okay. I didn't call your state actually meaning you were a state. Oh, okay. And he starts going off like, oh, y'all started clapping, and I'm like, yo, this is like bring it down just a little bit because they're already upset with you and now. They, they they don't like you at all. But, well, yeah. I just wanted, I didn't have the clarification. That's why I clapped. Just Fine. so you have to clap it up. That's okay. Okay. Well, I'm no, I feel this. I'm just letting you know that. I'm just letting you know that. Because I wasn't like that. Hey, hey, hey. Cool. I'm going to talk to Kadir for a second. Derek walks up to us and he said, Who was clapping? That's disrespectful. And I said, Oh, because there was some tea. And he said, What do you mean, who? And I said, Oh, no, 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 no. Don't come for me, sir. Lucky for me, I got ADD, so I was in a whole other world. I was talking about bagels for some reason, like I really want a blueberry bagel. So whenever I start clapping, I'm like, what are we clapping for? And then I'm like, oh, they're clapping. Oh, I'm back, I'm back. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, congrats, Kadia. But I didn't clap. But everyone's going, boom, 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 Kadia, Kadia. And I'm like, okay. Just because you were close to winning that challenge does not mean you're good. Period. I'm <laughs> just kind of like, dude, it's just a clap. It's just a clap. <laughs> I'm just asking what's going on. Why is everybody so quiet and intense? I'm asking. Why is everybody quiet and intense? Bro. Why is everybody quiet and intense? Why he acts like he had no hard feelings? He just attacked everyone. He's gonna go outside talking about some. I don't know why everybody's quiet and intense. This man called me out. I didn't do anything to you. I purposefully didn't clap. But now I'm feeling like I should have since you're gonna sit here and put my name in your mouth anyway. So you know what? I'm sick of this. We're done, Derek. We're done. We're never gonna be friends. Derek is a very explosive person, which leads to a lot of eyes focusing on him in the game, keeping them off of me. So Derek is my shield in this game. This whole Derek again? What? Why are we doing this again? You. Kadia won. Everybody claps on this show. Everybody claps on this show. I walked in and was like, don't clap every time because we you, you, you will clap all night. Like half the footage will be clapping. You know what I'm saying? But then like they clapped because Kadia won and Derek like, makes this about him. I'm like, dude, this wasn't about you losing. Like, I don't know where you like your brain made this about you, but it wasn't about you. Like, it's, it's, it was about Kadia, like, cause she won, and like, nobody's throwing shade at you right now. And then, I don't know. 
right after I had this little tussle with Luke, Kadia grabs me, she takes me outside. She's trying to calm me down, but I'm so heated right now. I'm at the moment where anybody can get it. You look at me the wrong way, I'm at your head. That's just how I'm feeling right now. Kadia takes me outside, we have a moment. She's telling me that I need to calm down because if I react like this, it's not gonna make people wanna keep me in this house. I ain't here for you to keep it in the house. I'm here to keep myself in the house. So I'm gonna do what I have to do in this moment, Kadia. Thank you very much. I'll listen to you, but let me do this. How will Kadia place her totem pole? And will Derek's explosion hurt his game? Who will be the switch and the defender? And who will be the next player eliminated from the game? If you want to be a Patreon and play Zoom totem pole games with players like Derek, Kadia, Josh, Luke, Nicole, and more, you can sign up to be a Patreon and even get behind the scenes footage, sponsor an episode, or get your own totem pole ideas made into a video for the YouTube channel. You can sign up to be a Patreon at the link below. Thank you so much for watching the totem pole. You can watch these other videos here or subscribe. We'll see you next week on Totem Tuesday.